Okay, so, hi, hello, welcome back to another Creepypasta story video. Today, Creepypasta I'm going to be reading is called James Outbreak. But, but, but before I get into it, I do want to say a few things. First off, the video is a one take, so if you hear me stumble, mumble, fumble, and mess up my words, I am sorry, this is a one take. And second thing, please consider using code GOONS at GamerSubs.gg. It's code G-O-O-N-S, and you can use that to get 10% off at checkout. Okay, so outside of that, let's get into it. This Creepypasta is called James Outbreak. The Manhattan Project was started in 1942 to develop the first nuclear explosive for use against the enemies of the U.S. In July 1943, Dr. James Albrecht, one of the project scientists, was accused of spying for the Germans. Albrecht's co-workers noted in interviews that the man stopped talking to anyone, and he seemed especially aloof even for a scientist. And just days before his trial, Albrecht disappeared, leaving behind a wife and two children. On November 17, 1998, Albrecht suddenly showed up at his younger son's home in Springfield, New Mexico, and upon realizing that the man was his father, Ethan Albrecht, at the time who was 81 years old, invited him inside and tried to figure out what had happened. But however, within hours of Dr. Albrecht's re reappearance, FBI agents arrived and took him away to his son's protest. In an interview with a local newspaper, Ethan noted that the Dr. James Albrecht hasn't aged a day. He looks as young as my son. The scientist also seemed to suffer from amnesia, and constantly asking where his wife was and when his trial is. And to this day, the government e even denies that Albrecht ever existed. Dr. James Albrecht was 68 years old when he, when he was invited to join the Manhattan Project. Okay, so that was a short creep pasta today, and also I forgot to put up the photo of him, so here it is. I don't know if this is actually Dr. James Outbreak, but it it's just kind of like a visual thing. So yeah, uh, so hopefully y'all enjoyed the creep pasta. Um, that was Dr. James Outbreak. Uh, yet again, with everything, uh, whoever wrote this is actually kind of smart, saying like, oh, the FBI wiped him completely from the records because that's what the FBI does. Do not trust the three letter agencies because they will lie to you. But you didn't hear that from me. I got that from Wendy Goon, so you know, it is what it is. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the creepypasta. Um if you enjoyed it, please leave a like and you want to see more, subscribe. I do have a playlist that will pop up on the right side of me that has hundred and twenty videos in it, I think. So go check go check that out. It will start from like Jeff the Killer to everything else right now. But outside of that, I don't really have any, anything else to say, but use code Goons at gamersubs.gg and all that good stuff. So, I do want to say, thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye, everyone.